Hi, brothers and sisters. It's Paul here. Um, I wanted to get this message out before the light where I live goes out. <laughs> I'm so happy to give you this message. I'm even celebrating with a McDonald's chocolate shake. That's how good this message is. So let me set it up real quick. Um, <clears throat> you, the last video that I put out, I had a couple of brothers and sisters that sent me they didn't, know, they didn't know they did, but three or four people sent me a video of another sister in Christ, and it was an answer to one of my prayers. So it was, it, was su it was such a beautiful message. Without any of these people knowing that it was an answer to one of my prayers, I took it to prayer for discernment reasons, and I asked God, I said, as much as I love hearing other people's beautiful dreams or visions, I don't take them at face value unless God tells me it's true. So without revealing who the sister is and, and what the dream was she shared, um, I'll just share you my dream and see if you can put the two together. So in my dream, I was witnessing this and I was floating very high above the tree line. I'm going to say about, say, 50 feet above full grown trees. And let's just say the trees are 30, 40 feet high. So I was quite high, like 80, 90 feet up. And it's not me. I was witnessing something. So I was looking side to side. It was the neighborhood I grew up in. And everything was beautiful. And and uh, I believe it was summer. There was leaves on the trees and stuff. So I looked down and I noticed my friend Mike, Mike uh, a good friend of mine. And I only see him when there's a representation of Archangel Michael. So seeing him caught my attention, and I kept floating along this street, which where I grew up, it's called La Rue de l'Église, and that de Église means fr the French word for church. So I'm going down this church street, but spelt in French, and I see Michael, and then I see my friend Chris, which for those that follow my channel, you know that I only see this guy when it means Jesus is trying to get my attention through the Holy Spirit. So I see him and I'm like, whoa, okay. In my dream, I'm like, okay, what's going to happen? So I'm looking forward through whoever I'm witnessing through. And then in, from looking down at the ground, the view goes upwards. And I'm facing the church that I grew up going to. So suddenly the view changes from my view of looking at this church to being behind it looking back at where I was and I see Jesus floating in the air can't see his face he's glowing beautiful sash on his white robe and it was beautiful and then the view goes back to behind him and I see Jesus land on the church and that's the end of the dream so here's what I prayed for I said, God, many of us, men and women, brothers and sisters, are feeling very weak now. Please. And I was asking for myself. This is actually something I know I normally wouldn't have shared this because this was an answer to my prayers. But I know now because I saw my confirmation card today at a very strange place. I never should have seen it. And that's telling me I got to share this because somebody, this is probably an answer to somebody else's prayer. So the sister had shared a dream and answer to her prayer was when are you coming Jesus and he showed her in a dream that like a, a groom coming to the church to pick up his bride he's almost there ready to park in front of the church so my dream was the answer to that which showed me Jesus arriving at the church guys I believe with all my heart Time is short. Jesus is coming back. Raise your hands and your heart and your mind and your soul with everything you got and praise God because he's sending Jesus very soon. I love you guys. This message is from Jesus, from the Father, from the Holy Spirit to encourage you. I love you guys. To the next video or in the air.